Can you describe the event and the incident that happened with the Cocker Spaniel puppy? So very early on on my placement, I think it was the second week, we had an emergency um, come in which was a 16 week old brown Cocker Spaniel puppy ran over to a husky which was on the lead and um, jumped on it, turned around and rolled on its back. The husky then dug its canines into its abdomen and um, sort of mauled it around and ripped it. So when it came in it was had its intestines hanging out, it had three surgeries and a lot of aftercare. What did you and your team do when the puppy got brought in? So me and the team were alerted that a red light was coming on its way. So we had to set up incubation quickly, set up theatre and then um, get the puppy straight into theatre because the intestines that were hanging out had become necrotic, so like dying tissue. So we had to quickly do put that all back in, snip out certain parts, stitch up and then start the aftercare process which was very ongoing. Have you got any advice for Cocker Spaniel owners? I'd say for Cocker Spaniel um, puppy owners and any puppy owners it's very important that recall is a top priority and I definitely wouldn't let a dog off the lead if recall wasn't 100%. How else are Cocker Spaniels usually injured or hurt? Um, I would say the main reasons that Cocker Spaniels come in injured into practice is by grass seeds. Um, and to avoid this, I would avoid taking your dog, Cocker Spaniel, um, into grass seed fields that have just recently been stubbled. If you do, always double check uh, in between their paw pads and in their ears after a walk and make sure you brush them thoroughly.